Remember to click subscribe and notification button for more Abbas video. Cooking Appa. Hi, this is Cooking Appa. Yesterday I saw on YouTube somebody from China, they are um, uh, having this very interesting combination on a bowl of rice where they have a komba, yeah, the braised pork belly and some veg green veggie and also uh, Taiwan sausage on top of a rice I, I think it actually looks very appetizing so I'm going to <laughs> recreate this particular dish here okay so what you can see here is I have three pieces of uh, pork belly approximately 250 grams uh, how do you choose a good pork belly well basically you want uh, what we call fei shou xiang jian, meaning uh, the uh, the layer between the fat and also the meat, you have uh, very evenly distributed. Okay, so uh, we have some pork belly here, and how do we make the uh, braised pork actually not difficult? Uh, here we have some uh, chopped ginger, garlic, shallot, and also coriander roots. You can also put in galangal, yeah, if you have and one bowl of chicken stock this is two to three pieces of star anise one cinnamon stick uh, one to two pieces of bay leaves and also some uh, five spice powder about half teaspoon there and one um, tablespoon of rock sugar so, uh, of course you will need some light soy sauce and dark soy sauce and saoxing wine yeah? um, if you don't have the uh, Five spice powder, don't worry because uh, the combination between star anise, cinnamon stick and also bay leaf will give you the five spice powder flavor. We're going to make the broth, the braised broth. Give it a bit of oil, two to three tablespoons to start with. And then we're going to saute the fresh herbs, ginger, shallot, garlic and also fresh coriander roots. And you may also put in some galangal if you have. Let's saute this for a minute or two before we continue. We will come back shortly. Alright, this is after sauteing for a minute or two. Next thing we can do is to actually add in the chicken stock. And we want to add in the rock sugar. The five spice powder, bay leaf, cinnamon stick. One, two, three, four, about four tablespoons of light soy sauce. And I'm going to give it about 2 to 3 tablespoons of dark soya sauce or caramelized soya sauce. This is more for the color. You have to control the amount of the dark soya sauce. If you put too much, it will become bitter. So be careful with that, okay? And also we will need to give it some good amount of saoxing wine. And you want to bring this to a boil. I will add in some salt. Right, our braised is basically ready. Now let me add in some few dashes of white pepper. Our braise is basically ready. Very simple, isn't it? So I'm going to put this into the pressure cooker. Okay, this is the inner part of my pressure cooker. I'm going to first put in the pork belly at the bottom. Pour the braised broth on top of it. Right, just nice. Basically, you want the pork belly to be nicely, just nice submerged under the broth. The pork belly is nicely submerged under the broth and I'm going to cook this uh, using my uh, pressure cooker using high pressure and cook it for approximately I would say maybe 15 to 20 minutes. If you are using a normal pot you probably want to bring it to a boil then uh, lower down the heat to medium low and cook it for about 45 minutes. Very interestingly, that video actually uh, eat the kong bak, yeah, the pork, braised pork belly together with uh, Taiwan sausage. So I'm going to do the same. <laughs> I actually think that these two will come together very well. Can I put some oil into the uh, wok or pan and slowly pan fry it for a couple of minutes and it is done. Okay, we're going to blend some siu bak choy or you can use any veggie you have. By putting oil and also salt inside the blanching water, it will help to keep the greenery, the greenish color of your veggie. Alright? 
So we're just going to blanch it for probably about below one minute, it should be cooked. Taiwanese sausage is done, blanched veggie is done, and my pork belly, braised or uh, kombak, pork, uh, braised pork belly is also done. So we are just going to keep uh, combine everything together. I have uh, one bowl of uh, nice jasmine rice here, and we are going to, I'm going to put, ooh, just nice, the Taiwanese sausage at the side, and green veggie also at the side and the beautiful komba toing, 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 toing. okay let me zoom in for you a little bit and here is the braised bra nice done you can also add an egg if you want to okay so uh, my um, how do I call this? My komba rice is ready. Uh, I hope you like my very simple video today. If you all the video you see on my channel, which is about over one thousand video today, are all my family dinners. Yeah, so uh, I, I'm sure my family is going to enjoy this dinner uh, tonight, and I hope uh, you can also enjoy your dinner with your family and your loved ones. Thank you very much. Bye bye.